Hello, it's LPS Jam and Abby here, and I have some serious tea to spill. So if you didn't know, Basic Fun has been giving us sneak peeks of the new LPS on their Instagram, which has not been active since 2018, in the form of a countdown to when they air a trailer for their new Roblox game. This was also a countdown to when they were going to attend the New York Toy Fair, where they would reveal the new LPS. Today I will share the photos we have seen from the Toy Fair so far, and I will also share my opinions and predictions for the new LPS. Here are all the images that Basic Fun released for the countdown. And now Basic Fun has released new images on their website banner that show the full images of the pets we saw in the countdown. These pictures revealed that the Himalayan cat has heterochromic eyes, and that the strange green thing we saw in one of the pictures is actually a caterpillar thing. But it only gets more exciting from here. We have also found out that there is a new LPS axolotl mold. It looks a little derpy, but at least they listened to us when we said we wanted an axolotl. So first is this adorable image of a goat. It looks so cute and it, it's just a gorgeous pet overall. And also when you take a closer look of its eyes, they actually look really good. I was kind of worried when I saw the picture of the pelican on the countdown because its eyes were clearly printed and they honestly didn't look very good. But it seems like in this goat and also in the other countdown pet pictures that the eyes seem to be quite good. So here is an image of a display shown at the fair. And this image is so interesting because aside from the amazing new LPS designs, there looks to be cards for the LPS. So this could be some kind of game or maybe just a collector thing, but that's really cool. And I really like the idea of being able to get cards for LPS. And it also seems like they might be re-releasing old designs too, because these two pets you see here, they already exist. I mean, they might be slightly different, it's pretty hard to tell from the image, but I think that they look pretty much the same as the pets that are here. And it would be nice to see them release old designs, but I'm honestly really happy that they're making new designs and focusing on that more. Here in this photo, we also see even more pets, and even accessories like this sushi platter and a music box. We can also see a new LPS Kiwi down there. The accessories they have shown so far definitely seem to be in the LPS style, and they look to be detailed and in good quality too. So it's great to see that we're going to be getting more accessories. Here we also get a better look at the packaging and I think we're mostly going to be getting singles and doubles packs from these images because that's the only kind of packaging they've really shown and yeah I think that's pretty good but I would like to see bigger kind of packs of LPS in the future. And we have not seen any play sets yet but hopefully soon. There is also this King Charles Spaniel that looks very similar to this Cocker Spaniel in its colours and design. So that's pretty cool that they might be putting designs from old pets onto new moulds. Here is a larger image of the entire display and they seem to really want to emphasise the axolotl. I guess because they want to seem a bit trendy maybe? So from what I can understand, the game is being released on the 10th of December this year and the LPS are being released in spring for the Northern Hemisphere but autumn for the Southern Hemisphere in 2024. So we will have to wait quite a few months before we can get our new LPS but it is still near-ish the beginning of 2024. We also found out that they will be releasing 140 pets next year and the fact that they say next year alludes to the fact that they might be releasing more pets in the future and continuing this like brand thing. I hope this video got you excited for the new LPS and we're probably going to get way more images because the toy fair goes on for quite a few days so we're probably going to see a lot more stuff but I just decided to make this video because I've just been so excited. So yeah, look out for future updates. Bye!